Hello once again fellow gamers, this is uh, Jason from Hexes and Soldiers. I haven't done this in a while so I thought I'd share a uh, kind of an unboxing with you guys, an interesting story behind it, or at least I think so. It was on eBay as I want to do and found something uh, that caught my fancy, bid on it, won. And uh, shortly thereafter received an email from the uh, seller um, informing me that uh, he in fact has a lot of other stuff in stock and uh, sent me an invoice of things from which I ordered a couple more things but um, the prices this guy has are uh, unbeatable and I've stared at things on eBay for months um, longing lustfully after them but uh, not willing to pay the price that they're asking uh, the, again the prices that he is offering some of the same things that I've seen is uh, again unbeatable so Talking about Alex Key, and here's what you need right here. I did this uh, in a hurry. I'm actually at work right now. Keys, Games, and Hobbies, hobbies747 at gmail.com. Hit this gentleman up and let him know you're interested in what he has to offer. Uh, he'll send you an invoice. And uh, again, when you see the prices, um, you'll be impressed. Now, he did mention that it's mostly ASL stuff uh, that he has listed, but uh, if you're interested in something else specifically, just ask him about it and he'll see if he has it or can pick it up. So I feel like I got the secret handshake and I uh, thought I'd share it with you guys. Moving right along, this is the box that it came in. And uh, I have to say, a lot of bubble wrap and shrink and... Uh, Probably one of the most fun packages, uh, and I'm not being facetious, this was a lot of fun to open, a lot of packaging. It was packed with um, care and love, uh, as if this was his own stuff. So, <clears throat> get right to it. This is what sparked the whole thing off, the Scenario Designer's Guide, by Mr. Mark Pitcavage, who has hands down the best ASL retrospective site on the net. No offense to everybody else, but it truly is. And uh, I read about this thing a while ago. I've never seen one available until recently. So bid on this, and uh, that's when I got the invoices from uh, Alex. And uh, based on that, I was able to get the final ASL journal that I needed to complete the uh, entire collection, ASL Journal 4. And this thing was on eBay for an ungodly amount. Uh, I don't know who was asking what they're asking but um, it was just ludicrous and um, this guy had this at probably more than um, how do I put this less than half way less than half what the other guy was uh, asking on eBay so ASL Journal 4 should prove interesting there's some uh, needed overlays in there and obviously this is out of print so hard to find and it looks good to me great condition and then something else that uh, I'm just about ready to do cartwheels over. Uh, another something that was uh, ultra expensive and uh, hard to find and just hadn't ever been able to pick up a copy. But uh, thanks to Mr. Alex, uh, I have one now. This is La Division Azul, or Division Blue Division. That's the Spanish uh, division that, was, uh, that participated in the Eastern Front. This thing comes with counters, it comes with scenarios, and as far as third-party ASL stuff goes, you know, I always told myself I would stick to the uh, M&P stuff, but um, when it comes to third-party stuff, uh, LeFranc Terrier, you, you, you probably can't do much better. No problems with uh, handing them over some of my uh, well-earned dollars, and look at this thing. That should be awesome. And... Um, I'm not sure I'm going to tear into this on camera. I'm holding the phone in one hand and I only have one hand. So basically this is, uh, this is what I ordered and a very happy customer. Again, uh, if you guys are looking for stuff that you can't find at reasonable prices, you need to hit this gentleman up and let him know you're looking for something. I'll flash his address here again. That's Keys, Games, and Hobbies. Hobby747 at gmail.com. Now you know. And uh, if you're interested in any of these things, you can read more about this on uh, Mark Cabbage's site, actually. 
I could be mistaken because, you know, I was just on there a day or two ago. And this, mysteriously enough, was no longer listed on there, so I don't know what's up with that. But, um, <clears throat> but this other stuff, you can definitely go to Board Game Geek or any number of sites and learn more about it. Um, this is going to be awesome. Completed the ASL Journal collection, and this should prove interesting as well. So, I'm a happy camper. That's it. Thanks for watching.